What's up, everybody? It's still wet out here. The hardest thing to get in shape, man, is these damn knees. I was talking about a guy. He wanted, he tell you he wanted to buy a couple of books. He wanted me to send him my cash app. My cash app is on my page. It's on my page. I send it in my emails. But they do that because they want to try to get you into a conversation where you send them the cash app, then you send them an email, and all this other dumb shit. Like all my asses. What's up, man? Good morning. Peace. I was throwing punches. That's how I used to get in shape. Throw punches. This shit goes dark. I can't even see this shit. I'm about to fight space and time. What does that mean? What does that mean? Hey, thank you very much. I can't read the names because I ain't got my glasses on. Prince of Excellence. 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 What's up, y'all? Hey, that's what you got to do. You got to throw punches. That's how I used to get in shape. Throw punches. Try to throw punches for the whole three minutes. <laughs> I used to be able to do 100 push-ups. I can still do them shits, man. Just got to get in shape. I don't like being on this corner. Yeah, but uh, I'm saying try to throw mini, throw punches. Throw punches for three minutes. I try to get out of here. I gotta go take care of some business. Yo. 
I was watching uh, Aaron Pryor and Alexis Arguello. I was watching, it was, this was the second fight. Aaron Pryor was just too strong. And, and people fail to realize that Alexis Arguello, he was coming up. He was coming up, I think, from 130. Something, he was coming up, he was coming up from a lighter weight class. I'm not sure what weight class it was, but like I told you, when a, when a boxer moves up in weight class, they don't take their punching power with them. And Aaron Pryor was a natural 140. And he was a strong 140. Strong. So there was no way in hell. But that shows you how good Alexis Aguero was for him to last that long in the first fight. He was a bad dude, Alexis Aguero. He just wasn't a natural uh, 140. He was naturally, I think, 130, 130, 135. He was coming up. What's going on out there, y'all? I gotta get out of here. Put my hat back on. Where was I 10 years ago? 10 years ago, 10 years ago, I was on 144th Street cutting hair. No, I had stopped cutting hair. I was on uh, selling my books. Why don't you get a copy? My book is called Corner Stores in the Middle of the Block. And I got another book of poetry. It's called Agitation Gets the Dirt Out. I sell my books for $15. Hit me up and I'll sell them to you myself. Use Cash App. My Cash App is dollar sign number one. Brad Bathgate. That's where I was. I was selling my books. I was selling my poetry. I got four books. One is called Corner Stores in the Middle of the Block. One is called Agitation Gets the Dirt Out. One is called Pretty Ugly, a Harlem Situation. That's a novel. And then I got one called Don't Beat Your Children or They'll Turn Out Like Me. And that's poetry. And my books are selling for $15. Hit me up on my cash app and I'll mail a book to you myself. It's dollar sign. Number one, Brad Bathby. I stopped fighting when I was in my 30s. I don't know. For me, you'll get them in four. There's four right there. They're playing around them, man. And then they're riding their bike and running behind her. And they, they bullshit. They bullshit. They ain't bull bullshit. They're not running. What's going on? What y'all say? I've been doing poetry for damn near 20 years. I'm about to leave this shit alone.
My books are sold for $15. I'll mail them to you 